Welcome back. Milwaukee has a rich German history and Kegels Inn is embracing a favorite tradition with its annual Muller's dinners. And I'm joined now by Julian Kegel to learn a little more about what this all entails. Thank you so much for making time for us. Yeah, my pleasure. Okay, Happy to so be here. set the scene for us. This is a four course meal mm -hmm. and the, while you're eating, what happens? Well, um, first off, you're just going to enjoy the authenticity of Kegels Inn. It's our 95th birthday this year and all the original murals, uh, the stained glass windows, the the warmth and uh, and conviviality of the atmosphere just really helps out set the mood way before the Mullers ever even show up, mm -hmm. right? So that friendly service, the delicious food, um, we've got all sorts of German specialties that are that we're absolutely known for. Um, just make the way to setting the scene so that when the Mullers do come, your belly's full, you've had a couple cocktails, and you're just ready to experience this show that is unlike anything in the in the city and what does this show entail you got several <laughs> characters right yeah. who are just kind of roaming around the restaurant yeah. well imagine um, in the country in in Austria uh, 300 years ago there wasn't a lot to do in the winter and there were long arduous ones just like here in Wisconsin so storytelling and the fear of darkness right really caused uh, the the culture to just start to create uh, a lively and colorful attitude towards it and just look forward towards spring, summer, and fall, right? So each of the four seasons is represented in the Muller show. So you'll see the headdresses of each season um, and they'll be totally different. So it's one of these things that just, it evolves every year and these guys are the only ones in America doing it. Wow. So. Uh, let's go yeah. back to the food. Sure, so yeah. what what can people eat? Well, in my favorite, I didn't try anything else other than the roasted duck at Kegel's Inn for 20 years as I was growing up. Wow. And that's still a fan favorite for mine. I'd highly recommend uh -huh. it. But our pork shanks, I mean, we get two massive pork shanks uh, with your dinner, uh, sauerkraut, everything's homemade, scratch gravies. We've really taken a tea to the, to the whole food business at Kegel's Inn in the last couple of years. And you said this tradition has been going on at the restaurant for 13 years or so. Yeah. What do you enjoy about it most? Um, I like pe people who have never been, it, been to it and they're brought by somebody that <laughs> has seen it before and then they, their lips are sealed because they don't want to uh -huh. spoil the show because uh, half of it is just experiencing it, right? And as the, as the guys get off the bus, you can hear the clam, the clam and clatter of their costumes. A lot of the guys' costumes are instruments themselves. Uh, so as they dance, they, they are noisemakers and then they dance with the music and get you involved in, uh, in all sorts of ways. So. And people yeah. can still join in on this, right? Are you selling tickets online? Or? We, we did s just sell out. Okay. Um, but we are doing a special meet and greet at 8 p.m. at Kegel's Inn. So the show and so the dinner and the show uh, is between 5 and 8 p.m. But if you don't have tickets, you can come into the bar, have a cocktail, and uh, and meet these guys in person, see the intricacy of their masks, and just sort of uh, dive into your own curiosity. Yeah, there's still a way to join in yeah. on the fun and learn about a different culture. There is. All thank right. You. Thank you so much for your time. Yeah. We'll have a fun.